my name is Joanne Cornell and I'm from A Roses Creations and I'm going to show you a video on the French press uh, hack that they have with the Levo machine. But I'm going to do a, something a little bit different because um, pressing it is a problem when it comes to the way they do it, but the way I'm doing it is going to work. Uh, so, first of all, because I already did it, so I definitely know it works. All right, so what I did is in this only holds about seven grams at the most, seven or eight grams of uh, any kind of herbs. So you can do it with cannabis, you can do it with uh, basil. Right now I'm doing it with basil, but instead of using these containers that they give you here, I'm doing it with the French press um, hack instead. So what I did is I got, and this way I can get more herb in here, uh, depending on what you're doing. I'm doing with basil and oregano. And I also threw in some sage in there. I all fresh from the garden. Um, can't show you the basil because the basil is already in there, but they go like this, like that. This is my sage, this is my oregano, and my basil is already in there. And what I did is to get more in there, uh, I took and put it in the blender. So I took my herbs, I put it in a blender, and then I mixed it up. Uh, if it's just regular herbs, you don't have to measure it. If you are using uh, cannabis, measure it so that way you know what the dosages are. What you're gonna need? Levo machine, you're gonna need um, French press uh, screens. They're like seven bucks and I got uh, two, three, four, five, so six. I got six of them for seven or eight bucks, I think it was. So uh, what I did is I took one of these and I put it down in the middle of the container that is in here. And then I took the little round piece that's in there and I put that in here just like it's supposed to be, right where it's supposed to be. Then I took the herbs and the oil and I mixed it in the blender and so that way it chopped it up and it kind of made it look like pesto. Uh, and then I poured it in the container here on top of the screen and the little round piece that they have which is the mixer so now it's in here so now what I'm going to do is I am going to infuse it because because it's not with a plug um, I'm not gonna be able to show you but what you do is you go to this button right here and it's gonna say um, dry and then you hit it again and it's gonna say activate and then you're gonna go hit it again and it's gonna say infuse that's the one you want when it says infuse and then it's gonna have direct it's gonna have a temperature and it's gonna have a time so take the temperature and go down 10 degrees less than what it is I think it's 140 uh, 150 so you're gonna go down to 140 and then what I do for the time is I go up to six hours because I want it to go longer I'm okay with that. Um, I don't want it to burn, and with these canisters, there is a silicone piece on the bottom that prevents it from burning, but uh, we don't have that in there because we have the screen in there, so that's why we're gonna do it 10 degrees less. So, when it's done, when it's done, you're gonna have your cup, and you gotta put your cup underneath it, which I have right here, and then you're gonna take and put, and then you're gonna use a press, and you're going to open up the lid, and you're gonna press down on it, and push it, and that's going to actually press the damn oil out. So then you're gonna push this button right here, and this button right here is gonna release the oil. But it's only gonna release some, because some of it is stuck into the herb. So take the French press, push down on it, and then you're gonna get the rest of the oil that you want. Then when you're done, you can take the uh, herb out with a spoon and you can either toss it or you can use it for cooking. I'm gonna actually use it for cooking, so I'm gonna take it and put it in a mason jar and I'm gonna probably put some salad dressing in and I'm gonna actually use it in my salad like that. Um, hopefully it'll be good, I don't know. I will give you an update on that, but that is the 
original hack and then I added my own little twist to it which is a French press because this way you can get all the oil out of this without having to have uh, doing a squeegee or doing a tea bag because normally you do a tea bag and you can squeeze the tea bag out this way you don't have to so hope you enjoy this video uh, like subscribe and uh, share and uh, happy cooking have a good night bye